my bybit account and if you go to derivatives then we click on derivatives features portal i'm going to show you the trade that i've taken today so this video is just going to teach you a step-by-step -step process on how to select a coin and trade so whether you are a swing trader you are a day trader a scalper anytime you wake up you might have to find a particular token that you are going to risk your money on and the coin that you are going to find it needs to be able to give you 10x 20x or 30x your money when you are using maximum leverage within 24 hours so in this video i'm just going to show you a step-by-step -step process on how to find a token and trade it either on binance or bybit so for us to do this if you are new to my channel my name is askanda make sure you follow me on binance right now we are over 28,000 people so follow me on my binance square you can also click on the first link in the video description so that you join my telegram group every single day anytime i share a trade for my vip members i also share a trade in the public group so that you can also copy along and make passive income so by the end of this video you should learn how to sort out a coin how to know whether the coin is legit and how to enter it using trading view and binance or bybit so at the end of this video if you have any questions i'll leave my number in the video or i'll just let you comment down below so that you will be able to give me the questions that i can do a video about it so first thing first for you to select a token you must first ask yourself crypto is 24 7 meaning you can just wake up middle of the night and take a trade but if you do this we call it gambling so you need to set rules for yourself so to set the rules for yourself ask your son is this the right time to be taking a trade no at the time of making this video the time is around uh 10 a.m in the morning that's ghana time so you ask yourself the country that you are and the current market session that you want to trade so for crypto i'll advise you you use two trading sessions you use new york session and you use london session it so it's either you select london session or new york session make sure you write this down after writing it down now you are going to go to a website called investing.com right so we go to a website called investing.com okay so we go to investing.com right now so i just go to investing.com okay so we click here so when we go to investing.com we are going to select economic calendar just to know today whether we have uh news coming from one of the major countries right usually if we have news coming from united states it causes a lot of distraction in the market so if we go to economic calendar around here so let's just go to economic calendar if i click on economic calendar right now so today these are the news that we are currently having so we'll go to the filter bar and filter it out so for us to do the filtering have you seen this filter bar at the right hand side so you click on the filter bar after clicking on the filter bar you uncheck australia uncheck all the countries and leave only united states just uncheck all the countries that are here leave only united states the reason why we are using united states is because it's the only one which is pegged with the bitcoin and because the dollar is pegged with bitcoin anything that happens to the dollar it tends to affect bitcoin and bitcoin control like 70 percent of the altcoin movement so we all know that if bitcoin is rising the alternative tokens also fall so what do i do then i click on apply here okay so after clicking on apply they are going to tell us the news that are currently active today so if we don't have news that are active today meaning we can easily trade so you can see today we don't have news so today's date is uh if october 2024 and we don't have news right so perfect time to take the trade so what i'll do now is i'll search for trading session so we go for trading session so we can either trade on london session or new york session so if i click here you can see we have what we call sydney tokyo london and new york so for now we are going to be trading on london session so this moment is the best time to trade so you always have to ask yourself whether you want to trade new york session 
or you want to trade London session so right now I'm trading London session so what I'll do is I'll now go to a website called coin market cap so the first step was to do what check investing.com second step is trading session third step is we go to a website called coin market cap so coin market cap is a gold mine for cryptocurrencies you can't be doing anything crypto related without visiting this website daily this website is very important for crypto traders right so the next thing that i'll do is i'll just scroll down so let me just exit this uh bar here it's like okay so we'll click on the coin market cap the logo at the left hand side right so you click on it when you click on it it's going to refresh the page then we'll select on the trending section so let's just give it some moment then we'll select on trending session so you can see we have trending session here which is we people and all those stuff so let's click on the trending section so after clicking on the trending section you are going to count from uh this thing one to ten do you get it so you count from one to ten so you have one here two three okay four five six seven eight nine ten so have you seen so we have counted from one to ten so we are going to select a token from this session the reason why we are doing that is because we want to invest our money in a token that has the ability and the capacity to rise do you get it don't just go and invest your money in a shit token you need to invest your money in a token that has proven to give money in the past 24 hours in the past seven days in the past 30 days so these are the tokens that people have currently invested their money inside so these are the tokens that we are going to be trading so like i told you we can select a token from this session and we'll just do our analysis on it so right now i'm just going to select a token like this one dog's fish so i can click on dog's fish here the most important thing of coming to coin market cap is one to find the token second to know whether the token is legit when we say legit we we are talking about whether the token is real someone can just get up and create a fake token so we want to make sure that the token is real and you can really invest your money in it and cash out and also if the coin is listed on either binance or bybit or KuCoin, if you are risking your money on a particular token and it's not listed on binance or bybit or okay i just run away now the fourth thing is for you to know the market sentiment what are people currently talking about the coin so if people are saying positive news about a particular token then we just know that within 24 hours time the token will start rising so i've just selected a token that i'm going to invest my money in that i'm going to trade right so and the token is called dog's fish now we can see the chart is in a downtrend so after the chart now we we'll move to what we call market session so just click on the market the market is very very important remember the market shows us where the coin is currently listed dogs so this is the name you should take note of this name at the top left hand side this name just take note of it and also look at here we can see the token is listed on binance it's also listed on bybit okx and coin meaning it's a legit coin so we can even trade it now we'll go to the uh, market sentiment which is the news what people are currently saying about this particular token so if people are saying positive things about this token meaning we are going to be buying it and also you need to ask yourself this question is binance or is uh bitcoin rising or falling if bitcoin is falling chances are there is 70 percent chance that this particular token is going to fall so if bitcoin is rising the token will also follow so i have a strategy that i'm using to predict the market i've just showed you how to select the token now we'll go to trading view right so after coming to trading view click on the left hand side have you seen this menu bar so you click on the menu bar you go to project right so when you go to project you are going to click on super chat super chat is very important right so i'm on super chat right now then what i'll do is let's say we are going to trade dogs so because we are going to trade dogs i'm just going to click on the 1000 start at the top left hand side again then we'll click we'll enter dogs 
dot p so anytime you enter dogs add dot p anytime you find the token you add dot p to it because we are trading perpetuals and also if you look at the uh all resources when we go to the right hand side we can see the chain which is available so we have binance bybit okx and kucoin this is where the token is currently listed which is very important and where you can trade it for free like where you can trade it easily that's why i'm saying only select a token that is listed on major exchanges if you are trying to trade spot or features with leverage it's just like you want to trade solana and you are going to use think market broker you can trade it there because it's not listed there you can only trade the token if it's listed on the exchange that you are on so i'm going to select an exchange like binance or we can even select an exchange like bybit so let's select bybit here so this is the current price of dogs now i have a 15 minute strategy that i'm going to use so that we can predict the market so i'll just do what i'll change here to 15 minutes so i'll scroll down and change it to 15 minutes after changing it to 15 minutes i'm now going to do something important i'm going to add indicators that are going to tell me whether i should buy or sell this particular token Okay, so I click on the indicators, then I go for moving averages. You type in exponential moving averages, then you click it once. Okay, so I just click it once. Then what I'll do is I'll double click here. After double clicking, now change the color to like something green. Then I'll go to the style, select the second style again, go back to the input, then you make it 25. So with the input, we go with 25. And the method will select EMA for exponential moving average. Now I'm going to click on the second moving averages. Then I'll make it period 50. Then I'll go for EMA two. Then I'll select EMA like this. Okay. So we can even leave the color blue. So we click on style again. Click on the color. Then I'll select the second one. Then I'll just confirm. So right now in the 15 minutes time frame of docs. It's currently telling us we should sell the market is in a downtrend so because the market is in a downtrend what are we going to do we are going to use the forecasting tools and we'll enter a short position remember to follow me on binance it's very important this is my page for you to get lister information on cryptocurrencies how to invest and make money or how to even trade how to use your money wisely make sure you follow me on buy now so let's go back now we are going to enter a short position using the 15 minutes time frame i usually target one is to three but before we do this remember i was telling you that always check to see whether bitcoin is rising or falling so if bitcoin is rising chances are the strategy might not be respected if bitcoin is falling chances are the strategy might be respected or might not be respected if bitcoin is rising the alternative tokens rise if bitcoin is falling the alternative tokens fall but if bitcoin is consolidating if it's not moving in a straight world direction meaning the market will fall so we are going to enter a short position using the uh, forecasting tools like on short but before i do this i'm going to change here to btc so i type in btc dot p just to know whether bitcoin is rising or falling so i select buy bit here so if i select buy bit you can see right now this is not a perfect time to enter a trade on bitcoin this is not a perfect time because bitcoin is currently making an uptrend in the 15 minutes time frame bitcoin is trying to rise so because of that i'll wait then maybe one to two hours time maybe new york session i'll come and see if this moving averages are going to be above the candlesticks then i'll sell but if they are going to be below the candlesticks then i'll start buying so i'm telling you that this is not the right time to be taking a trade we need to give it like one to two hours time so this is how you find a token and trade i've just showed you a step-by-step -step process on how to find a token and they trade it on either binance or bybit in 2025 so if you have any questions comment down below make sure you follow me on binance and click the first link in the video description to join the telegram team